<laughs> All right. So today on our show, we have Alan Fine. And uh, starting in late 2012, Alan began niching on LinkedIn. I'm not even sure I knew what LinkedIn was in 2012 because it's the largest B2B database in the world. In the world? In the world. In the world. You can find, you know, because remember, Facebook is not B2B, boys and girls out there. You can find Alan on LinkedInLeads.ca. That's LinkedInLeads.ca. We'll have that up later. B2B lead generation service working through LinkedIn. He's literally helped hundreds of business owners over the last 20 years take their business to the next level. I am so glad to welcome Mr. Alan Fine. Wait, Yay, here he is. Now we can all clap. Yay. Yay. Happy New Year, everybody. Hello, Alan. It's 2020. I want to know where the flying cars are. Yeah, no kidding. They're not here yet. They're not They're not here yet. But we do have same-day delivery from Amazon. So that's, that's right. There you that's go. Right. That's, that's impressive. And more important, Other drones. I think. For so sure. how are you, Alan? It's great to see you. I'm doing great. I'm in uh, cold and snowy Calgary, Alberta, Canada now. Yes, I was born in Toronto, and who knows, we might be related in some way. I have lots of people in Toronto I know, and cousins like you do. Yeah, yeah. And, and do they have? Do they? Do their last names end in vowels, as all yes. Italian names do? Yes. No, <laughs> all of them are fine. <laughs> all of them are fine. Well, there, there you go. Okay, that's a good analogy. I like that's, that analogy. That's a yeah. great analogy. Yeah, and, and you know, people who go to networking meetings all the time. And you just go, you know, well, nothing's happening for me. Well, just think of this for a second. This is going to bake your noodle. LinkedIn is the largest networking meeting, and it's happening 24-7. And you never have to leave your home, and you can wear your pajamas. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's what we say about this show. You could wear your pajamas as long as you're dressed from here up. Yeah, exactly. Well, that's, that's interesting that you're saying that. I I like that. It, it's the – it's a – continuous 24 seven networking meeting. Yeah. Um, and the biggest problem I think is getting through the junk, getting through the crap, getting through the people that the business card dealers, you know, the ones at networking yeah. events that just hand out business cards. Exactly. I, and I, we have the same type of people on LinkedIn. How do you get around that mess? Well, the first, the first thing is to, you know, make sure that you have some things done like your ducks in a row. And for instance, you know, having a phenomenal looking profile. Is there somewhere I can, sh some way I can share my screen on my side? Uh, I believe. There's a screen, share screen button, I think, on the bottom here. Yeah, there's we a just, share screen uh, button. And uh, go ahead and here. put it up, and then we'll figure there. out where to get it up on the screen. Okay. So share. And then here is my LinkedIn profile here somewhere. Here we are. There we go. Right. And so here's here's me. And, and let me just say, for those of you who are listening on the podcast, we'll go ahead and have a, um, a link to Alan's profile so that when you're not driving and listening to the podcast, you can take a moment, look at Alan's profile, and see what you should be doing with your profile. So. Yeah, just di dissect it. It's pretty, pretty easy. You know, uh, uh, a nice-looking cover banner I think is very, very important. It shows people that you're professional. It also creates that, you know, first impression that you really got your stuff together when you have a great profile, a nice picture, um, smiling. We've all seen people's pictures on LinkedIn what look like serial killers, and uh, it's really we have right. Yeah. Or, or you see the picture of someone professional and they're you know doing beer bongs in Mexico on the vacation. Oh, gotta so love it's really that. gotta love yeah. That. You know, so I mean, you really want to make sure that you have those things done. Also, you can see this over here, right? My company. If you see a gray box over here, like you see for my train to trainer thing, I don't have this over here done properly, but don't, this is old. But for your company page, make sure you have your company page and make sure you create a company page and then have it connected to your profile. You'll know you do when you've loaded your square logo up to your company page on LinkedIn. And you can see the little icon here. So, Catherine, what are you and I doing as soon as we're done with, with this interview? As soon as we're done with this interview, we're going back over, although we, we have taken other LinkedIn courses, so we're not as bad as some people are. And, uh, yeah. 
Yeah. And then making sure you have your a nicely written about section, which is you know written in such a way that it solves your customers' problems. Always. People, yeah. People don't necessarily, you know, think about uh, or, or care about the fact that you're the CEO of your company. Right. They want to know what can you do for me and what problems you solve for me. And I think that goes with every aspect of your business and all parts of your messaging. It's not me, 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 me. It's what I can do for you. How right, I can exactly. Solve your, what pain points do you have and how can I solve that? Exactly. It, and and there's something, Alan, that, that we teach our clients and people who follow us and everything is stop saying the word I. Whatever, whatever it is, you have got to know what it is that you sell and what you sell is a solution. It is not a widget. It is not a service. You sell a solution. And that's what Alan is telling you right now to put in there. Is the yeah, exactly section, yeah, and 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 also you know, not only is what's my solution I sell, but why is it for you, and why am I different? Because you know, usually when you go on LinkedIn, you can type in a, a phrase like you know, marketing on LinkedIn. Well, look at the number of people we have: fifty-one million people who are, are in, in marketing on LinkedIn. Right. So you know. Why are you different? Why are you unique? Why are you better than other people? All those things need to be communicated on your profile. That you just want to let everybody know about. Yeah, download know. the LinkedIn app to your phone also, and put on your phone in your note files pre-formatted messages that when people are talking to you on LinkedIn, as opposed to having to write every message from scratch, you copy and paste and then then just you know add their name in there and maybe a couple of key points you want to change on there. But once again, a system for using LinkedIn mobile app that when you're sitting there, let's say in the doctor's office or somewhere else and you're waiting for appointments to happen and you're sitting there just you know reading a magazine, go on LinkedIn for 10 minutes and get some work done. It's very easy to do. That's huge. Yeah, well, it's huge. Yeah, it really makes a big difference. All amazing stuff, all, you know, professional stuff. LinkedIn is where you need to be as a professional. Find Alan, by the way, uh, for those of you who are watching the video or watching this on YouTube, Alan only has two L's in his name, not three. Yeah. Alan was typing away at the very beginning here, trying to get on this call and, here. And uh, so <laughs> it is link. Alan, A-L-L-A-N, fine. Like everything is fine and dandy. So it's Alan, A-L-L-A-N, yeah. fine. Look him up on LinkedIn. Take it's, a look at what he's doing. And he'll put so the profile, uh, profile, profile link, link on there here. Yeah, I've got your profile uh, link up there already. And it, okay, it right. actually, let me just go ahead and show that. There we go. Right, perfect. LinkedIn.com slash. Send me an invitation request. I'd love, love to connect with you and actually talk to you on the phone afterwards rather than just having you on my on my connection list. We'll talk. That, so, that's, a, that's a neat trick. That's a neat trick to pick up the phone, which I know a yeah. lot of people hesitate to do, but it's, it's something yeah. that we need to do. Yeah. Alan has given so much great stuff. If you're if you're listening on the podcast, take a moment to go to cohencoaching.com and look at look up the podcasts and get all of Alan's links. Yeah. All the Alan's webinar links. Um, it you really need to to up your game with LinkedIn. Stop futzing around on Facebook. I mean, it's nice, it's good. Your clients may be on Facebook. It depends on what you do. Your clients may be on Facebook. And your clients are definitely on LinkedIn. Your uh, collaborative partners are definitely on LinkedIn. The people, business to business, that you need to know to do your business are most assuredly on LinkedIn. Be a professional. Be a professional there. Go ahead and download Alan's information. Um, update your profile. And if you can, get on his webinar and, and get with him. The course is amazing. The webinar is going to be amazing. I can't wait to get on to it and yeah. get with Alan. For sure. Well, thank you so much, Barry and Kat. Thank you for having me today. Sure appreciate it. Thank Thanks, you, for Alan, being and everybody else. We will see you on the next episode. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye.